Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm super excited today because I'm going to share with you another Miss A unboxing haul. Yes, I placed an order. It came in this huge, oh my god, this is huge, huge, huge bag. So I placed an order and I had a really great idea to do a fall haul. So this is fall inspired items, fall inspired makeup from Miss A. If you guys are new here, hi, welcome. I've done quite a few Shop Miss A hauls. I've done tutorials. I've done reviews on a lot of their brush sets. So I'll put lots of links to other videos that I've done already on my channel. So definitely check those videos out. So grab a drink, grab some pumpkin spice, uh, latte <laughs> i've got my water we're getting all spooky up in here and let's do a fall haul Ooh, okay that's why this is so big there's bubble wrap on the inside so that's why this is so massive they must have changed their um, packaging to prevent things from like breaking all right let me just be quiet and open everything up oh wow all right, so that took a hot minute. So I laid everything out. I checked my list because they did send, you know, they do put your packing slip. So everything is here. I accidentally ordered two of the same lipsticks. So if I like it, I have a backup. <laughs> so the AOE Studio line is cruelty-free. They're certified cruelty-free. And I really love their products. So most of this is from that range. This right here, I have not tried. It's the a plus setting spray and primer spray duo so you can buy these separately or buy them in a pack and i believe this was well they're a dollar 88 each and i think together it was like three dollars or something so here's what it looks like that's so cute they come together so here is the primer spray for smooth even skin now you guys know i have a love-hate relationship with primers and i haven't really tried a primer spray before have you guys tried a primer spray Oh, okay. Oh, that smells nice. So hopefully it's good. We'll have to see. I'm definitely gonna do, I think, another video trying everything out and doing a fall makeup look. So that'll be coming. I have to say, I'm really impressed. 2.5 fluid ounces. Give it a little shake. Oh. Oh, okay. Okay, that is really really heavily fragranced. I mean, it feels fine, but let me just tell you what, if you don't like fragrance in your setting sprays, you're really not going to like this. That is really strong. It actually smells like perfume. All right, I have some makeup here, which I'm really excited. Some new things they've launched, some things I have tried. So this is something new from their AOE Studio line. It's their Pro Wear Foundation full coverage. I do have their other foundation, which is actually pretty good. It's more of a satin finish. Two shades. I have porcelain, which is the lighter one, and then buff. All right, so we have porcelain, which is definitely leaning more of a yellow undertone, and then we have buff. Buff definitely has that kind of peachy pink undertone. I'll probably end up mixing these two together because buff would probably be way too dark. And this one would be way too yellow and light. So I'll probably just mix the two when I use it. But wow, I only applied a little bit, you guys. It's thick. It's very pigmented. All right, so since we talked about foundation, let's talk about setting powder. I love this powder, so I had to get a backup. This is the AOA Studio Perfect Finishing Press Powder in Translucent. So this is just a backup that I have because this one I have already hit pan on it's a dollar it's really really great powder you guys if you haven't tried the aoa studio press powders they're so good and so i thought for my fall full face of fall makeup i thought it'd be nice to try one of these as a bronzer so i picked two kind of like medium toned shades and i do have quite a few to choose from so i'm hoping that i can use one of these as a bronzer i'm thinking the shade almond it's just so good you guys so that's the shade almond that might actually be too light of a bronzer so here's the shade toffee again they come in a pretty nice range of colors let me swatch this next to the other one all right so here we have uh this one is toffee and then that one is almond so i did pick out one blush and i i have another one of these 
and I don't know what I did with it. I think I decluttered it a while back and I kind of regret doing that because these are actually really good and they're one dollar. And they're super cute in this little tiny packaging and the lid just screws off like that. So this is in the shade Dandy. It's so pretty. It's kind of like a peachy coral. I was kind of going for a more like spicy pumpkin color but yeah nonetheless I will still use this just probably more in the springtime all right moving on to highlighters I have not tried these yet and these are the AOA studio cream highlighters so this is the first shade we have is called dream and this looks like a more yellow toned highlighter okay i'm really really f hoping <laughs> that this works well applied to the skin that is beautiful okay that is stunning so this is the shade opal and again this has a very slippery very dewy feel opal right here which definitely has a stronger pink undertone and now that i see them swatch side by side i feel like that first shade called dream almost has a rose gold it looks more rose gold so we have this one which is uh dream and then opal right there i almost forgot about this this is the contour stick it's the aoe studio sculpt fx and i picked the shade nutmeg and again if it doesn't work i can use it for like halloween tutorials or when i'm doing more creative makeup looks you know, I'll find a use for it. So that's the shade Nutmeg. I know these are for contouring, but I was kind of hoping <laughs> to pick a warmer shade. That is definitely very deep. Way too deep for me. So this is something new I have not tried is the AOA Studio Brow Gel. This is something new that they launched not too long ago. It's their super pigmented, long lasting, smudge proof brow gel. Now I do like the undertone of this color. So that's medium brown. It's a nice, deep, cool-toned brown, which I definitely prefer. I'm gonna give it a try, you know, with a light application. I feel like this would be a good color. All right, let's move on to the eyes. I have one eyeliner, and this is, again, another new product. It's the AOA Studio Gel Eyeliners. Now, I only picked out one shade. So here's what the end looks like. I don't understand why it's, like, so far down in there. So I'll probably have to sharpen it. All right, so here's the shade Burgundy. Now this does have some shimmer to it. It is very light, so you do have to really go back and forth a lot to, yeah, so I don't know, this might be a dud. It might be a dud, we'll have to see. All right, more eye products. I purchased two more of the AB Studio Buttercream, Buttercream <laughs> Gel Liner and Shadow. So you can use this as an eyeliner, or an eyeshadow and these two colors you guys I knew I had to get so the first one here is a matte matte color it's called Java chip nice matte brown and I don't have a matte brown like eyeliner and I thought this would be perfect to do like a wing eyeshadow base you know for some dark fall looks all right so here is the shade pumpkin so that's the shade pumpkin oh my gosh it's the perfect like copper penny pumpkin color oh my gosh i cannot wait to use this this is the perfect fall color so i'm really happy with these shades they're exactly what i was hoping for so i was only going to purchase one of these but i saw one of the models on their website wearing two shades mixed together on the eyelids and i just had to get them so these are the new loose pigments from the aoa studio line they have so many colors to choose from they have cool tones warm tones and you get a lot of product there's six mils of product in here which is a lot and i believe these were again a dollar so the first shade we have is called grail and this is definitely a very like true gold so there is no sifter which I was kind of hoping that there was a sifter, but it's just pretty much a pigment. So this is the shade uh, Grail. It's a beautiful, very bright, almost like a silver gold, like a white gold. Oh, 
you guys these are so good okay the other shade i got is called enchant this is the one that i thought would be so pretty i think all of these are perfect for fall a sort of rosy pink with this gold shimmer shift this is kind of like a duochrome oh my god wow now i know that we're still in spooky season we're still in october so this one is called spell these are incredible so this is the shade spell swatched at the bottom so this has i would say that kind of reddish brown undertone with this kind of greenish blue like metallic duochrome i i don't even know how to describe it but there you go those are the three pigments wow that's all i have to say <laughs> all i have to say is wow those are stunning the last two like makeup things i have two lipsticks these are the aoe studio i forget what these are called so this is the shade shore s h o r e this is a little bit more pink than i was wanting i was kind of looking for like a brown nude but that is really pretty these are really creamy they're really nice they're kind of long lasting so that's the shade guava it's a little bit deeper it's definitely more of a warm like a warm nude so these weren't exactly what i was wanting but nonetheless those are really really pretty all right let's move on to some fun tools i haven't tried these yet again new item these are the lash applicators i believe these came in a few different colors so of course i picked the black ones look how cute that is these are really nice so it is a metal uh, material definitely feels a lot like their tweezers which i have them here somewhere nice matte black with the green logo okay these look really nice all right and then the other tool i got is the uh lash curler the one i have is actually falling apart she is shiny she is brand new and i cannot wait to use her has the little logo at the top it also comes with an extra pad attached right here that's what that is so you can easily remove that if you want to all right let's talk about lashes they came out with a whole bunch of new uh the 3d foam ink lashes in a lighter style so these are not as dramatic as the ones i'm wearing i'm actually wearing the style jean today mm -hmm. those are like my absolute favorite lashes of all time um, so this one is in the style Nora these are really pretty now these are more on the natural side and I thought these would be really nice to just try out and then these are in the style Amanda and these look really fun they're kind of spiky oh yeah and then these I'm really excited to play with these are the individual lashes from the AOE studio line and I purchased all three of them since they're only a dollar each. You know how expensive these are at like the drugstore? They can run anywhere from like six to eight to ten dollars. So we have the long flare individual lashes. Next we have the medium length. And then we have the short length. And these were i think a dollar each that's such a steal because these can get really expensive at the drugstore all right so moving on to some fun little extras i wanted to get another one of these cubes because i have a black one and i love it so much and i got the rose gold oh okay this would make such a good like christmas gift you know the holidays are coming up that is so nice and you just take your sponge of course mine's dirty i'm sorry but i'm just going to show you a little demonstration <laughs> you just put your sponge in there let it dry or just store it in there if you want to and it's perfect so i wanted to give this sponge another try it's the mochi wonder blender and this is a limited edition color it's like a peachy coral and it looks like this. I actually really do like this sponge. I like this kind of flat side here and it's so soft. So yeah, I'm gonna give it another try, another chance because I wasn't too impressed with the first one I used. It didn't last very long. So I'm hoping, fingers crossed, that this one's better. Now this I'm really excited about because I love this sponge. This is my favorite Miss A sponge ever. It's the Paw Paw Wonder Blender. And now they sell it in a pack of six. 
I'm so happy that I have lots of backups of my favorite sponge. It's so good, you guys. You don't need to spend a lot of money on a, a beauty sponge. This one, it's amazing. I had to get some backups. All right, and then I have just a few more things and we're almost done. So these are, again, new to the AOE Studio line. They're the Pure Sanitizing Wipes. It kills 99.9% .9 of germs. So they come in two different, I guess, fragrances. There's mint and this one is lemon. I really hope that these are good. I thought I would go ahead and try them out and see if they're, you know, worth trying because I've been really struggling to find sanitizing wipes and this is perfect because they're small, they're on the go. I thought this would be perfect to put in my bag when I'm going to the grocery store. I can just wipe down any surfaces that I need to, to like sanitize and just try to, you know, keep yourself safe as much as possible. All right, and last but not least, a couple of random things. I have two hair accessories. <laughs> and again, I will link everything you guys down below in the description box. Look how cute this is. Now, I'm not big on like hair accessories, but I'm gonna give them another try. Look at that print. That is so pretty. I thought this part here was really cute. I've been wearing my hair down a lot lately and I thought, well, this would be kind of cute to just sort of pop in your hair. All right, and then the last sort of hair accessory. There was so many things I wanted to try, like some hair clips. I needed some extra like hair things, like scrunchies. They had really cute scrunchies, but they were all sold out. That was really sad. This one, again, perfect for fall. Look at this color, you guys. It's a super bright, like, copper red. We have to try it. It's too cute not to. And see, this one is so tight, but look how pretty. Oh, it's cutting off my circulation. All right, this has to come off. All right, let's try this one. All right, I'm really liking this. So cute. And it actually matches my makeup really nicely. That kind of like mustard brown color, which I think is really unique and different, but perfect for fall. All right, guys, so that is it. That is my massively huge Shop Miss A haul for fall. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a big thumbs up, but I hope you guys did enjoy. I will link all the products down below in the description box. Now, I am a Miss A affiliate, so I do earn a commission if you do use my links. You do not have to, you have no obligation whatsoever, but I will go ahead and list everything and link everything down below. If you are new here, make sure to hit that subscribe button. I post on Tuesdays and Fridays every week, and you can also find me on Instagram. Again, all links will be below. I'm gonna get off of here. I hope you guys have a fabulous day. I'll see you soon in the next video. Bye guys.